Medellin, Medellin? I, I don't know how to say it properly, but Medellin or Medellin. <laughs> Are you guys ready for this reveal? You want me to remove my hand? Because I look insane. I look like a crackhead. There you go. <laughs> You're doing that TikTok? Oh, I'm doing everything. <laughs> Hey guys, guess what? I'm heading to Colombia to get my veneers finally replaced from composite to porcelain. Let's go. I look so crazy. I've been on a flight for like 10 hours. Let's see what this room is given. Okay, this is really cute. This is so cute. Not too bad. Oh, look at the view. Looks kind of dark, but this hotel is recommended by the clinic it is located inside of the mall and it's walking distance that way you won't miss your appointment okay guys so i finally arrived to medellin medellin i, I don't know how to say it properly but medellin or medellin something like that but in colombia look at the view look at the view okay um it is like about two o'clock and i'm going to get my new veneers i've had these ones for five years and they need to come out i've been saying this for like the past two years these need to come out i hate the color i hate the shape like it's composite it's starting to get yellow in between it's time to come out so i found a new dentist out here actually a couple people went to and i'm excited my appointment got switched from today to tomorrow morning so i think today i'm just gonna chill it looks cold outside it looks wet i'm probably gonna wash my hair because i look like an oily dog i'm gonna let a few clumps of white dog hair ruin the moment and just work on some content and chill and watch some movies until tomorrow morning um yeah my room is pretty cute i'll show you guys the video it's not bad and it is brick i packed flip-flops two bikinis to hang by the pool like i wasn't thinking properly thank god i wore like my fall jacket because it is so cold <laughs> it is actually brick tell me what you're sipping on right now I'm sipping on that hot cocoa right now i ain't gonna lie it's a little brick um so yeah i will keep you guys updated for tomorrow i'm so excited like y'all don't understand i've been trying to make the time to come out here for over a year <laughs>
and it's finally happening. I want the pearly whites, the perfect, the good shape. Period. Because the shape is just not given no more. I don't like it. Come out, come out, come out. So, yeah, I'll keep you guys updated. Okay, just washed my hair. Now I need to figure out how I'm going to straighten this because it's a lot. I look a little crazy right now. My edges are. I need to work on that, but you know. Okay. Looking like I'm about to go yodel. And then I just take my bonnet, tuck it behind, put that on. And I look like a cute little sunflower. All right. Okay, good morning, everybody. It's like 6 or 7 a.m. I'm so tired, but my appointment is at 8. So I'm gonna take these out, see if the curls work. So I look somewhat cute. Go have breakfast. See, look at that. I'm gonna take it out. Go have breakfast. And then walk over to the clinic. It's, it's swollen. Whenever I wake up. Okay, I'm praying for positive vibes today because yesterday I felt like the clinic kind of played with me a bit, a bit. And they better not be on that time today. I just don't have the energy to cuss somebody. Basically, you know, I made this appointment months ago, showed up, went through hoops to get here. Um, and when I arrived, they tell me, oh, sorry, the doctor changed your appointment. What do you mean he changed my appointment? I'm here, I need some job. Yeah, what do you mean he changed my appointment? Why don't you change your appointment to tomorrow at eight? So why did I leave the day before and land yesterday at 8 a.m. to be ready for my appointment at 2 to make sure I was punctual and that if there was any delays that I would be on time? I mean, like the professionalism, it's like, why wouldn't you guys let me know before I came that my appointment was going to be changed? And the reasoning for my appointment to be changed was apparently yesterday was a holiday. I mean, y'all live here, y'all know that it's a holiday. So they said there was no AC or something like that in the clinic. And if I wanted to come, I could still come, but it would be hot. And they advised me to come at 8 a.m. the next day. It's not gonna affect my appointments and blah, blah, blah. So I'm like, all right, you know what, Monica, just, just go with the flow, go at 8 a.m. I'm on their Instagram and they're taking appointments yesterday. They have people up in the clinic. Bruh. <laughs> so yeah. I don't know what that was about. This is my morning routine. I'm looking for complete. Um, I think it's just like I forgot my whole stand. I think I should be more organized. Shawty get thawed off in my 
Team passenger, this a G5, no, this not a challenger Big one. I keep some members with me in the fridge The coat seats, they some cannibals Eat us. They like the geek, geek Drink a whole bottle, wake up and repeat Damn. She took a look, mixed it with the chill out Now she say she saying 3D wow. I go in the jungle and they got a coat I bet I come out with a me I bet I do this shit for the fam Cause this shit bigger than me Three. Color throws in my infinity link And in the factory masterpiece I call on twin, could that be my brother We got the same roller, he matching me Nah, for real Water on me like the sun of sun Care some pointers All these commas, I won't fun from Me go gunners out the jungle We buy it all, fuck a front Fuck nigga, cake on me, no fun Who cares? Drop top, feeling like stunner Drop top, KD play, no runner We gon' chrome my wallet Smoke my pilot Ooh. Take the revive to the trappers Trap it Nigga want shit. shit I was outside just serving narcotics Narcotics Ooh. Play me that stick Nigga made one wrong move, just pop it Pop it <laughs> on broke with the whole flooded out in the hotel lobby it's crowded. Diamonds be dancing like Bobby. They dance. Don't touch it, dick like it be cocky. Don't touch. Shroom and GC the party. We geek. Bitches gon' trend on the top. Keep trend. The way I pull up, I'ma pop it and none of these niggas gon' stop me. Pull up. Gone. Put that shit on, get a cup for the drip. I'm on motherfucking five. Keep low. Keep stacking your bang, get bigger. Go. Never would. I throw some shit on no nigga. I'm take you. Little nigga, don't blow with these niggas. No. I see the big picture. We up on these niggas. Oh. The huncho, the one you gon' call on me, nigga. Yo. I got your back, you gon' follow me, nigga. Wow. When I get up, we gon' ball on these niggas. Wow. Fucking shit up, cause we beat out the system. Fuck. Water on me like the sun of song. Carry the song. Point is all these commas. Oh, yeah, okay, fuck, fuck, me go gunners out the jungle. We buy it all. Fuck a front up, nigga. Cake on me, no fun. Who cares? Drop top, feeling like stunning. Drop top, KD play, no run. We gon' chrome my wallet. Smoke my pilot. Take three glasses. Okay, guys. <laughs> I'm back. Um, I'm in my room. I'm tired. I'm exhausted. It was a long day. So far, I mean, long morning. I finished around two o'clock. The procedure itself, one out of 10, pain being on 10. I would say it was like a seven for me, sometimes a nine. I'm a big baby. Sorry, I have my hand over here because I look insane. I cannot believe I did this to myself. I am hoping that I didn't f my face, f my mouth. Like, let's just pray, guys. Let's pray. This is my first appointment. Tomorrow I go back. They put on the veneer. So today, they, I chose which color I wanted. I chose the style, all that kind of stuff. And then they did, they took off my old veneers because I had composite. And then they prepped my teeth. So I wanted minimal to no shaving. 
um, but of course they have to do some to uh, do your porcelain veneers. And once you do porcelain, there's no going back. Like there's no, okay, like I'm taking this off and wearing my own teeth. So sometimes people like they want to do porcelain, they want to keep their teeth. It's kind of like, but why? Because you're not gonna get it back to how it was anyways. But I don't want like little pegs, you know what I mean? I still want teeth, but girl. <laughs> Are you guys ready for this reveal? You want me to remove my hand? Reveal yourself! Because I look insane. I look like a crackhead. Oh, you ain't catching no crackheads. I look in insane. And if you guys screenshot this, <laughs> I hope you die, because why? Ah! Uh... Okay, mm. my skin's breaking out, but mm. this is my teeth. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> so, minimal shaving. <laughs> my mouth hurts. I'm still frozen. My lips are swollen. I break out easy. Big man thing, yeah? It's not oh, looking no. good, babe. It's not doing it. It's not looking good. I'm tired. I'm going to order room service. And probably just watch Netflix or something because I feel like we've been through a lot. I was crying. Uh, I was shaking. Because <laughs> I'm not good with needles and all that kind of stuff. It was a lot. But I'm excited to see the final results tomorrow. And yeah, just to have my pearly whites. And I know it's going to change like my whole face. So stay tuned for tomorrow. <laughs> mm, getting some food in my system. You see that view? Ooh, shit. Mm -hmm. I'm probably not gonna have the bread. But I mean, when you eat one, you got, you know, what's the name? Brown got eliminated. I didn't eat one, too. We interrupt the regularly scheduled program to bring you this important message. No, this filter is actually me. Like, the teeth doesn't even need a filter. crazy but I'm like over it today was my second appointment and it was supposed to be my final appointment but I have to go back tomorrow my veneers weren't ready the shape was a little not what I wanted it just wasn't really satisfied and to be honest I'm a bit annoyed because I just feel like it's been a lot of back and forth and like pushing back my date and come back tomorrow and all this kind of stuff. But you know, like they have a process, so I just have to be patient. Um, so I'm supposed to go back there tomorrow at 8 a.m. I can't even talk properly with my preps, but um, go back there tomorrow at 8 a.m. and they're going to finally cement them on. I'm a little nervous 
because it's different. I originally have small teeth um, for my big smile. And that's why I got veneers in the first place um, five years ago. So the new veneers, because they also cut my gums a bit more. I've had my gums cut before twice. So they cut them a little bit more. I feel like my teeth are huge. <laughs> I've never had this much teeth in my mouth before. So I'm just kind of like, did I make the right decision? Am I going to look like a horse? <sighs> I feel stressed. I look stressed. <laughs> I like you can tell I am stressed out. So today I've been like FaceTiming my friends throughout the appointment trying to make sure everything is okay because sometimes I'm like really indecisive and I can't make a decision and I need like other people that I'm close with their input to tell me like if it looks good or something's wrong or whatever but um yeah they said it looks nice I guess I just have to get used to it because I'm so used to my old teeth but hopefully tomorrow I have a better reaction. Hopefully tomorrow I'm happy and through the roof because today, I don't know if it's because I thought they would be on already so I'm just over it or if I just wasn't what I expected. I don't know, but we'll see, we will see. So I will keep you guys updated tomorrow. Have a good night. funny because the anesthesia is still on me I'm swollen look at my smile oh my god I look like a baddie look at this look at this ah, my lips are kind of up and down but bitch I'm gonna be walking over like this from now on <laughs> 